Hey, what is up, everybody? Welcome back to Late Night Fright. So this week, we're back with a brand new theme, and that is our Gothic Horror theme. So, uh, yeah, uh, you know, this week is the theme, so last week we had our horror battles. I uh, thought it was a really good week overall. Definitely go check those out if you haven't seen them already. And, uh, yeah, so the movie that I'm, I'm going to review for this theme is a movie that I haven't seen in quite a while, but I still remember pretty well, and that is The Woman in Black. During afternoon tea, there's a shift in the air, a bone trembling chill that tells you she's there. There are those who believe the whole town is cursed, but the house in the marsh is by far the worst. What she wants is unknown. But she always comes back. The specter of darkness. The woman in black. The Woman in Black was made in 2012. The director is James Watkins, and it stars Daniel Radcliffe. And the general plot for The Woman in Black is a young lawyer travels to a remote village where he discovers the vengeful ghost of a scorned woman is terrorizing the locals. And that is the general plot for The Woman in Black. I haven't seen uh, the second one, Angel of Death or whatever. Uh, I've heard that it sucks really bad, so I'm not uh, I'm not going to go out of my way to watch it. Uh, I thought the first one though was really decent, um, not like spectacular, but it was uh, it was creepy in moments. I'll give it that, uh, like the toys and stuff. I don't know for some reason that just creeps a lot of people out. Me not too much, but it still has that eerie vibe to it. Um, and the story, it was, it was okay. I mean, we've had stuff like this before. Uh, sadly, that's what this modern age is about, mostly is paranormal activity movies, which I'm not a huge fan of. If you are, that's fine. You know, we all have different tastes. Uh, the effects, uh, from what I can remember, were uh, oh, the, pretty decent. Uh, I did like the acting in it. Uh, Daniel Radcliffe did a really good job. I've never really seen him in too many serious movies. Um, but I did think he did uh, really good. Um, nothing, too, nothing really else to go over about it. Uh, just if you haven't seen it, I'd recommend watching it, see what you think about it. Uh, so, yeah guys, I didn't know I'd be stopping this video so short, but if you liked the video, please give, uh, <laughs> give it a like. Uh, comment down below what you think about this movie. Um, do you hate the second one if you've seen it? And, uh, yeah guys, just stay tuned for a video from Vanessa and the J. Sloan. Uh, Mike filled in for Jordan on Monday, and now uh, the Jason will be doing his video Saturday, so stay tuned for that. And yeah, guys, if you haven't seen uh, everybody else's videos from this week or last week, definitely check those out. They're really good. And uh, yeah, so uh, <laughs> once again, guys, this is Jeremy telling you to be careful, because you never know what might be lurking in the shadows. Mm -hmm.